Hello, Mr. Sushwit Kumar. Welcome to your PDA. Let's start your snap interview on the subject of digital electronics for your yeah. DRO interview preparation, right? Yeah. Sushwit, tell me, uh, what is the difference between latch and flip-flop? Uh, both are sequential circuits. So generally, mm -hmm. uh, latch is a level sense to element and uh, flip-flop is a it's sensitive. And uh, we need a... Generally, we need a tool as to, uh, required for designing a flip flop. Tell me, first of all, what is the purpose of the clock in entire digital electronics? What is the purpose of the clock? For synchronization. What do you mean by synchronization? Uh, so, uh, synchronization is uh, like uh, every uh, sequential element will work at the either at the positive edge or a negative edge of the clock. So, for the rest of the time, it will be in the same state. Mm -hmm. What is the purpose of deep flip flop? It's just a, a delay element. Uh, it will give the same in output as a. If that, if that is the case, you can input. take AND gate. No, instead of deep flip flop, you can take directly AND gate. Yeah, AND gate is a combination circuit, but uh, for deep flip flop, so it's generally uh, we will get the output at the next clock edge. What What do you mean by that? It means what is the theme? You are saying that uh, our deep flip flop output is same as the input, right? Yeah. Take, take an AND gate. One input, you give the input whatever you want to reflect that the output, the input. Other input, you connect with the clock. Yeah. Does it, does it don't serve the purpose? It's like a latch. It's not simply, it's like a latch. It's like a latch. Yeah. It's 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 behave like latch. Tell me what is the basic difference between sequential circuits and combination circuits? Um, sequential circuit, uh, we do not have any memory element. Like, uh, we, uh, sorry, in sequential circuit, we, uh, we it's it is not able to store any uh, data. So in combination, uh, sorry, sorry, in sequential circuit, is it possible to store the data? But in combination circuit, it's not. It will uh, directly uh, respond to the input. Tell me then, latch is a sequential one or a combinational one? Latch is sequential. Sorry, I'm wrong with uh, the before one. It's not then able how to come the... is How come no, no. is behaving like latch? No, I'm, I'm, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. Mm -hmm. See, I'm performing some addition. Okay. Yeah. Binary addition. So how can I recognize that overflow is there or not there? So, so if any carry generated from generated uh, from the uh, out of uh, from the MSB, after the MSB, then it will be an overflow, sir. No, see, all that is going to happen with help of gates and all circuits, right? Yeah. So I, I given you two binary numbers. You are not adding physically. Okay. Yeah. Those two binary numbers given to some adder, adder circuit. Okay. It is given some output. Okay. okay. So whether overflow is there or not there, whether the output is correct or not, how, see, what is the mechanism you're going to keep in the circuit to recognize that overflow I'm talking about? Uh, if we get the carry out in the, after the MSB, then I think it will be overflow, sir. I'm, I'm not sure about it, but this much I know. See, by using n bits okay. in two's complement form, what is the maximum negative number we can represent and what is the maximum positive number we can represent? It's 
so the maximum negative number is uh, 2 power n minus 1 and 2 power n 2 power n then minus 1 and the maximum positive number is 2 power whole n minus 1 mm -hmm. what you told is correct or not you can check by taking 4 bits yeah by using 4 bits so the what is the maximum, maximum number positive you number is uh, 7 and the uh, uh, negative number is minus 15 mm, then you check it 2 power 4 uh, you said maximum positive number is 2 power 4 minus 1 right yeah 2 power 4 maximum minus 1 negative number no, no, no. Maximum negative number is uh, 2 power n, then minus 1. 2 power n minus 1 or 2 power n after that minus 1? After that minus 1 is the maximum negative number. If that is the case, 2 power 4 minus 1 is how much? Minus 15, na? Yeah, minus 15. So you, you mean to say using 4 bits you can represent uh, minus 15? Yeah. Can you write its binary equivalent? Minus 15 binary equivalent using 4 bits you can write. Yeah. Write and tell me. Sorry, sir, I was wrong. Sorry, sorry. It's a uh, two power n minus one is a maximum negative number, and the maximum positive number is two power n minus one, then minus one. Yeah. So, Sushwit, let me give you feedback. Sushwit, uh, I didn't find clarity in your concepts. Okay. I'm trying to confuse you. You're getting confused. Hmm? Okay. So, revise it once, uh, starting uh, uh, from where. See, the questions like uh, why two's complement is preferred, why not one's complement? Okay. How to recognize the overflow bit? There are many methods. You can use XR gate. Okay. Okay for checking overflow and uh, uh, applications of uh, multiplexers, designing a higher order multiplexers with lower order multi multiplexers. Hmm? Okay. Applications of demultiplexers where you get these kind of things. And uh, uh, there are some advanced digital design concepts also. They may ask you to uh, design one circuit. So they will give some typical scenario. They may ask you to design that circuit. Hmm? So if you have clarity, then we can go in. in yeah, in I want to go. I want to proceed, sir. No, no, no problem. I I want to get to because uh, by mistakes I can know where I am doing wrong. Okay, so tell me why two's complement is preferred. Why not one's complement? Uh, because uh, So in two's complement form, uh, uh, we can able to uh, perfectly represent the negative terms, but in one's complement, uh, it's not possible for, I think uh, even if it is a plus zero or minus zero, oh. it is the same. Plus zero minus zero? Uh, it is the same, like if we take uh, So you you... You are not having clarity. See, your answer seems like uh, more or less it looks like uh, you remember something. No, 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 no sir. Like, like no uh, if we represent a minus one, uh, we can able to represent a minus one in two's complement. But in uh, one's complement, it is like zero, 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 sir. I think. Oh, let it be. What is the problem you have? Okay. Even for zero, it is zero, 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 sir. Zero, it is zero for minus one. Also, it is zero. Yes, sir. Once complement means what? Number mm -hmm. you one time you complement. How come minus one is zero zero zero? Like, uh, like if you take one 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 one, yes. if we do the complement, we will get zero 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 zero, sir. And okay, even for zero zero zero, it is same number. For two's complement, it's not. No. 
See, the representation of plus zero and minus zero both are not same in one's complement form. Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah, minus zero is one 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 one. I think plus ah. zero is zero 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 zero. Yes. It's not minus one. Minus zero is one 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 one. Yes, correct. See, for four variables or five variables, somehow you can go with K map. Imagine you have some twelve variables or fifteen variables. Then how you are going to simplify that circuit? Boolean simplification. The practically KMF is used in industries for the simplification of Boolean expressions. Up to four variable, four to five five variable, it's okay to go for KMF. Mm -hmm. But for higher order, uh, not able to get sir. I never went. Can you design? Time. Can you design two bit comparator and show it to me? Two bit comparator. Yes. Switch with. Yeah, yeah, sir. Uh, I have a brief idea. Like for equal to b, we use x nor gate. Tell me the idea. I I don't yeah. know the design. Tell me the basic idea. Okay, sir. For a equal to b, we go for uh, x nor uh, x nor gate. No, I uh, asked about two bit comparator, na? Yes, so, sir. In in every binary number, there are two bits. Yes, sir. You equate. See, there will be one number in the units place and tens place, right? Then you have yes, to sir. compare. Suppose, for example, you see there is a x naught y naught x one y one. First, we compare x naught with x one. Yes, sir. right. If both are equal, then we go for y naught y one comparison. If yes, x naught itself is greater than x one, then so that way the idea has to has to come, na. Yes, sir. If yes, it sir. is one bit comparator, we are going to say x naught gets something that that is okay, fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like I I return like this, sir. So I am comparing. Oh, it's, two, it's quite big, no, no, no. You wrote just the truth table, right? Yes, sir. So all possible combinations you taken, right? Yes, sir. Like how many combinations two. are there? How many combinations uh, can? Could you please? Sixteen, sir. Hmm. Sixteen. How can you say it is sixteen by counting? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, uh, yes, sir. For uh, for we are comparing two bit, two bits, and. I will tell you, for for uh, zero zero. In A, we will get four combinations. Means each each and every number in A is going to compare with the four numbers of uh, B. So like that, A is having four. Four with four is sixteen, right? Yes, sir. See, that is very lengthy process, na? Yes, sir. Switch. So you must come up with some logic where uh, it is done. It should be done very easily. First, you compare uh, A not with B not. Yeah. If A not is greater than B not, obviously we can say that A is greater than B. Yes, sir. If A not is equal to B not, then we go for the comparison of uh, uh, A one with A1, B one. B one. Yeah. yeah. Right. So yes, that sir. way you you can do it uh, very simple way. And let me give you Sushmit uh, feedback, Sushmit. Sushmit. Yeah. See, yeah. I told you this is not a subject like uh, remembering something. It it is a subject where you have to come up with your own idea at that moment itself. Okay. That way you try. Otherwise, uh, it it is going to be difficult for you in the interviews, right? Okay.